Hey friends, welcome back to part three of my vintage journal flip through. Today I have the journal magazine, I have a pic magazine, more McLean, some newspaper, and so we'll get started right away. And again, very fragile. They are ripped. I really love this. I'll have to uh, tape it up in the back, but I definitely want to use that in one of my junk journals. She's advertising vegetable oil. Now they're telling us not to eat vegetable oil, right? I hope you can see the whole magazine. They're so big I can hardly have them fully in view here. She's going to chop up a steak for supper, you guys. What are you having for supper today? I think we are going to have sausage and kielke. For those of you that know German, you'll know what kielke is. It is uh, fettuccino, I guess. Fettuccino noodles with a nice sauce and a barbecue sausage. Oh, I love that. That's a nice vintage cutout. What's happening here? He looks very sad, and I think she's trying to cheer him up. Interesting. I, I love seeing what's in here, and I'm seeing this with you guys. So I'm quite excited to see what's going to be all in these magazines here today that I'll be flipping through. Live that dream. Be quite interesting actually to read some of the stories that are in here as well. Hope you can see the full magazine there. So let me adjust it a bit there. Maybe that's a little bit better. It's hard to get that fully in view here because the magazines are so big. Advertising chicken noodle soup. Interesting. Ooh, what kind of cake have we got here? Looks like a lemon four decker cake. And even the recipe, that is so cool. I will definitely use that. I love finding vintage recipes. I think he's eating a lollipop or something there. Some black and white pages here. Oh, my hands, they get so dry. Paging through here. She's enjoying her afternoon reading books. Advertising jello or puddings. Jello pudding. I like these black and white models to cut out for the junk journal. That's pretty cool. Why are they putting Miracle Whip on pineapple? That is strange. Never had that. It says, only Miracle Whip can make pineapple taste so good. I beg to differ. Pineapple tastes fine just on their own, in my opinion. Heinz tomato soup. Love that. That's cool. Oh, that is a very vintage kitchen. Look at that. Love that kitchen. Oh. Some beautiful cutouts over here. Okay, it's the end of that. I love this vintage fridge photo here full of food. Definitely one to use. <clears throat> oh, is that the same as this that was ripped? No, this is different. Beautiful, beautiful book. Now let's see what this one has. It says pick, so no idea what kind of magazine this is. Or what I'm getting myself into here. Definitely very, very aged. No need to coffee dye this paper, that's for sure. All natural coffee dyed. 
vintage looking. Oh my word. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Not sure what those girls are doing. Interesting. I have no idea what this magazine is actually about. Oh, what's happening there? Some kind of therapy. Stretch clinic therapy for babies. <laughs> That's interesting. Oh my. all about the baby therapy oh goodness is this magazine even appropriate to post <laughs> oh man I should have looked at it first but it is it has some very cute pictures in it chicken farmer Vet clinic. Beauty treatment. Back in the day, they wrapped them all up nice and tight. I think they thought it would make their uh, jelly belly go away or something. I don't know. They had these really weird... Things that they did back in the day for weight loss. Not sure if I would use a whole lot out of this magazine, but maybe some of the black and white aged paper with just the, the writing on it. Now we're going to check out another couple of uh, McLean's. Maybe you would enjoy rather just a quiet flip through. You know, back in the day, my, my mom and dad, in the evenings when the day was done and supper was finished, they would go sit in the living room and they would read stories and flip through the newspaper and read the newspaper. And just sitting there listening to them flip through the paper and the, the, the sound of the turning pages was so relaxing to me. Until this day on, I absolutely love it. I find it very relaxing and therapeutic. Do any of you enjoy that as well? Just the sound of paper. This is a fold out here. Huh. Interesting. Just a huge fold out of cars. Sure advertised a lot of smokes back in the day, my goodness. Don't care for that. Love this these sides of paper here. I could definitely cut them in half and then include them in into my 
mixed media art or vintage junk journal for sure. Okay, let's see what the next one's got. Oh, goodness, this one is dirty. I'm finding them almost gross, but yet I'm finding them super interesting. That's a very vintage bedroom. Sorry, it was a little bit out of the view there for a minute. Some of the books are definitely more interesting than others, but I uh, had no idea. This is the only way to find out by flipping through them. Let's see what we all got. More vintage cars, of course. 1962 Oldsmobiles. I want to try not to make these videos too long. I'm pretty sure you would get bored of it if I if I made them too long so but I'm also not wanting to rush through it too much as well so hopefully this is all right what I'm doing here and should let me know okay so I got one more and then I've got a very interesting newspaper Again, with the Pepsi advertisement. This one almost looks the same as the other one. Lots of forest fires back in the day, too. Ooh. This is the same. It has the same inside as the other one that I flipped through. But the cover is different. Okay. Then I know. And so this is a free press weekly magazine. And this one is from 1963. And it is very fragile. It is not... Oh my, can I fit it on my whole screen here? This is going to be super awesome for, for using in the journal. Old time haystacking. I'm sure these would be awesome stories to read. Homestead. Okay, then we have flipped through the bunch I had set aside for today, and I will be flipping through two more yet. So, two more Mondays so you have to put up with me, you guys. But I promise there's some interesting stuff that I'm going to flip through yet. 
different magazines. Some are different magazine than what I have here, and some are also the McLean. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, if you did, thumbs up, share it with your friends, leave me a comment. We'll see what you think about these uh, vintage magazine flip-throughs. Till next time, thanks for watching. Bye.